school before you learned about your numbers. That's right. why they condition you when you were a kid. That's what I was saying when I was talking about the story. When 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 you was a kid and you mm -hmm. talk about these things, when you was a little kid, you you talk family values. Your parents tell you don't talk to strangers. They tell you do this. They show you how to tie your shoes. They 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 they, they show you everything. Teach you everything, and and, uh, and you go off this and then you get the food. You you you're gonna soak in what them teachers tell you. That's right, right. And you don't know why? You want to know why? Hold on. You want to know why? It's called it's called conditioning. But do you want to know why? What's 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 what what is actually what is actually supporting their knowledge? Books. And then not only books. They try not only books. Nope. Nope. Not even books. Nope. You want to know what it is? What? It's the household. The parents. Think about it. When they taught you about the globe. That's why it's called conditioning. Because when they the taught you about brainwashed too. So if you look at it, the yep. whole chain is brainwashed and it goes on and on and, and it on. strengthens itself. It strengthens itself. The only way to break it is to really break it. Now, the only way to really do it is to wake up the older generation, which is us. So our children are going to be woken up because we're woke. So when, 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 when they first taught our generation about the globe, we brought that shit home. Now, I don't know how many of y'all really really was talking about and, and the globe and really the globe, doubted what, that shit what bro sanchez said about the globe he said if you look at the bottom of the globe it says for educational purposes only ain't that some shit but that, but, but yeah this is what they tell you the world looks like but yeah. for educational yeah. purposes only it's a, no, not, only. Not, not for educational only. Purposes. Yeah, yeah, yeah not yeah 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 not yeah not right. for educational purposes but don't that tell you something yeah, bro. Yeah. Like when your child, like, bro, that, like bro. that's wild, but they, but they want to teach you that's what the world look like, and that's what the planets and the stars and the moon, man, this bro. shit, wow. It's all, uh, it's all in the, like brother Sanchez hit the nail on the head, bro. He said he said they're trying to get you away from the mother. That is true. Everything is an attack on the mother, even, bro, bro. And I'm gonna get real serious right now, hey, bro. It's all hey, about the women, bro. I mean, what would it gain from it? Is all about the women. Men do they everything average, average to please a woman, it's like globe and all that. They, they have nothing to gain by lying to you. Say it one more time, brother. We couldn't hear you. What do they have to gain by lying to you that the F is a globe? All right, let me let me let me build, let me build, let me build with them. Let me build with them. I got this, I got this, y'all. The reason why they will lie about the globe. Is because if you really thought break, of, if you was really break, break down the flat earth cosmology to him, man. No, no, let's... yeah, bro. Look, check this oh, out. Okay, okay, well, explain it to him then. My, my, let me get out of this. Y'all, yeah, handle that. Yeah, I'm gonna meet this my This is mic. why this, this is why this is why they want you to think the earth is a globe. If the if they if if they know that they've taught you and you believe that the earth is a globe, then your your thoughts on earth is not personalized. You don't feel like that's your world. You feel like that was a world that's created before you. It belongs to other people. You're just insignificant. You're just a speck of dust that came out of God's fart in the universe. For one, the same people that tell you about the fucking globe tell you God don't exist. The same people that tell you God don't exist is doing what? They trying to find life in other worlds. What the fuck are you finding? Why are you looking for life in the other world if you don't even believe God exists? So basically, NASA is telling you they're chasing a fucking another fart in the universe to happen that's going to build another earth, uh, build another world where other people can live. And they, they're selling this shit, literally selling this shit. When when bro Sanchez tell people about this NASA budget, he ain't bullshitting y'all, bro. Five, five, 50 million fucking dollars a day, bro, coming out of this country alone every fucking day. For what? Now, now, if the earth is not a globe and NASA is taking all of this money from everybody, what are they? What is their agenda? That's the point. Now, it's not about um, are they lying or are they not? We know they're lying. Now it's about why they lying. So. When we think about why they lying, we got to look at the facts. The facts is when we go outside, we see nature, we see nature, we know something created this shit. We know we are human beings. We see animals that don't look nothing like us. They can't speak like us. We are obviously different from them. Something created every moving, living thing on this planet that we live on, with this plane we live on. 
Now, flat Earth cosmology works like this. If you look at a, if you look at a, at a circular round plate, okay. Um, if you if you're looking down on the Earth, what the Earth really looks like is a big ass island of multiple different what we call continents, but it's all one big ass right. island. If if the Earth is flat, as you say, and there's eclipse, when there's an eclipse, I mean everybody on Earth should be able to see that eclipse. Why some part? Why only some part of F? I mean, that, at that moment, I'd like you know that people. I hope you get what I'm trying to say. Okay, I mean, okay. Why, why don't everybody? Expect, I mean, I mean, see that. Can I explain this one? Yep. Go ahead, bro. Okay. So the the reason why is because first off, the sun and the moon are way smaller than what we've been told, right? So don't yep. look at it as yep. is, uh, uh, you know. I can't remember uh, the exact number, far, but it, it's so much the bigger. Sun and the moon are. They're not far at all. The they're sun with, and the moon. Are, the sun and the moon is only 30,000 no, miles not, in the air. You know, one, you are saying they are not far at all. Okay. And how come then, if it's not far, that means it's easy for them to get to the moon. If it's not far. So why don't you believe they went to the moon if it's not far? Because the moon is a light orb. It's not, a, it's not an actual physical... You know, it's, it's not physical the way we are. It's, it's, it's a light orb, and you can't land on light. Now we now that's a theory, but we 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 strongly believe in that theory, but we we haven't proven that yet. Now it's still a possibility that the moon could be an actual object. That's still possible. But the thing is, the sun and the moon are the exact same size, but they move at different speeds. Now the trail, the, the tracking, the track that the sun and the moon rotates on is actually rotating around the 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 the, the uh, above is, is is rotating above our heads in a circular pattern, and the moon as well. But they're at different speeds, so that's why you get an eclipse every now and then. Now the reason why you can't see the eclipse from everywhere in the world is because of perception. The sun and the moon is not as big as they as as, as they teach us it is. Is nowhere near as big as they teach us it is, and the moon is nowhere near as big as they teach us it is. So, if 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 I got an eclipse, if I can see the eclipse over here, and I'm in, let's say I'm in Australia, there is no way you can see the eclipse across so, the middle, so the, across the North Pole. If you if you on the other side of the North Pole, and I'm in Australia, and I got an eclipse, you can't see that eclipse where you at. Maybe you won't be able to telescope. see. It. Unless you got a telescope and you you on you on something high, you standing on something high, you got a real real telescope, you'll be able to see it. But other than that, won't happen. And another thing, if the Earth is a globe, how in the hell do you have all of these polar regions that have night and day, and or, or night and flat, day for long extended flat, periods of time? Are they at the very edge? Say it, say it one more time, brother. We can't hear you. If if, if the earth was flat, uh huh, sailors will fall at the edge. Whoever said it was no, the edge. No, 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 no. Go ahead, he ain't get on, bro. Who, 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 I mean, what happens when you, when you still find out? Are you going to hear that? See, see, see uh, uh, most of us believe that that. Okay, so the way it works is, is that the North Pole is in the center, right, and South surrounds us. That's the way we view it. Right, and the South has a, a giant ice wall. These are things you can look up online, right? These are these are things you should already know anyway if you watch National Geographic and stuff like that, because they always showing these ice walls. Yep. They never giving explanations about them, but they always showing. And the ice yep. walls are over two hundred feet high, and they hold in the water. Water always finds its level. That's why it's always called a sea level, right? So if you looking at the if you looking at it from our perspective, then you will see that. Even if even if there was an edge, you wouldn't be able to access it anyway, just off the simple fact that you wouldn't be able to survive I, I, those I'm, conditions. I'm gonna put the ice wall up there for them. Can, can y'all see the screen? I'm gonna put the ice wall up there for them. Hold yeah, up. I can see the screen. And the and not only that, there. hold on, I, I got you, bro. And, and not only that, right? Not only that, but we believe or well, some of us believe in an infinite plane. So they keep I trying do. to give us to, to believe in this infinite uh space. Right, but we don't believe in it. We believe that we are in uh, even even our so-called space is an enclosed system, right? That's all a part of us. You know what I mean? And we don't believe uh, this whole big planet, you know, 
plan is this, plan is that, because those of us that do have telescopes that have used our telescopes, you can see that them planets don't look like that. At all. They ain't nothing but At shimmering all. lights. At all. They yep. shimmering exactly. lights in the sky the same way as our stars are. Yep. Yep. And 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 the, and, the, and the reason why we know that is because the 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 colors that are projected from those objects and the colors that they show us when we do see those planets do not are not the same they do not exactly they don't match up the same exactly yep now another thing i want to touch on is the fact that the indoctrination process is basically half and half for them to lie to you they're not going to they're not going to flat out tell you a straight bold lie why because they still need people indoctrinated in today's society as well. They still need people to join their fold just as well as they need to see how many people or what the rate of people waking up is. So they're going to put half truths in their lie. So when they tell you the infinite space, the only thing that was true is infinite. Right. The space part is a lie. The whole blackness part is a lie. The real infinite infinity is in that is on that ice, that ice, that see the ice. But you see, but you know what? Uh, Vegan Warrior had a had a video at one point, and I watched it, man. And he 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 made me feel some when he said what he said. He said, "What if?" He said, "What if NASA, when they took that when they when they jumped off when they jumped on that rocket and they and they got up above the Earth and they really looked back on the Earth? What if all they saw was blue? Mm. All they saw was blue on going all going on for infinite infinity. Nothing but blue, blue, blue everywhere. Like and they, they can't come, they can't come back down and explain that shit. They can't come back down and tell motherfuckers we living on an infinite ocean. Right. They can't tell nobody that. They can't tell nobody that Earth is surrounded by ice rings and that there's other islands out there and shit. You know why they ain't gonna tell you that? Because they know damn well. That the gut they need permission to talk about this type of shit because for one, for them to even go out in space like that, they needed permission. And in that Masonic order, you know, it's a hush hush situation anyway. You know, yeah. it's it's the reason why the Masons don't have a damn one window and not none of their lodges. There's a reason for that. We got yeah. one of the well, I don't know if it's one of the biggest. I ain't been all over, and I don't, and I don't really deal with Masons like that. But I do know that here down here in Atlanta, we got one of the biggest. Mason lodges that I've ever seen personally, and that motherfucker ain't got not one window. Yep, they but I get but, they can't see all guess what? But guess what? I bet you they do got. I bet you the motherfuckers got a sunroof or a fucking moon roof where they can see the sky at night. Oh, hell I yeah. bet you. I bet you they got. I bet you on top of every Mason lodge they got a fucking room, a, a fucking window on top of that building where when they inside they can see the stars and shit. I guarantee you that. And not only that, I guarantee you every Mason Lodge is where it's at for a specific reason. Yeah. Every Mason Lodge is where it's at for a specific reason. I guarantee that. Because these, you got to understand some These Masons, man, they ain't no joke. They got the truth already. They had the truth for hundreds of years. Right. So, so we can't underestimate these motherfuckers. They probably, they, they've been spinning circles around the world for, for years, which is why they came up with the globe. They running circles around us while we in his bitch thinking we 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 spinning around on the ball. These motherfuckers trying to explore new islands and claim them shits. Let's see, yeah. hell yeah, and, and and you know another thing is that uh, when you, when you, when we talk about secret societies or whatever you want to call them, high, high societies, whatever you know, we know that. The ones that's the one, the ones that's out in the open, the ones you know about ain't the dangerous one. Nope. You know what I'm saying? It's the, the, the ones you don't ain't, know about. That's that's the that's that's the low rank. Them the you foot soldiers, I mean? they, man. Every yeah, gang got exactly. one. Every exactly. gang got a foot soldiers, man. Yep. There's an A team and there's a B team. B team, you know. Yep. A team, they the real killers. Them they is, call yep, shots. Yep. Yep. The B team is the street team. Them the yep. ones who promote who promote the damn the the, the agenda. You know, it's nothing for them to them to them to, them to get a hundred motherfuckers to wear a mason jacket and wear it wear it throughout the public so other people can ask, what the fuck is that? Oh, come to the lodge, join us. Right. You know, that's not, that's their recruiting tactic, bro. So it, it's no different if you was a rapper, if you was a rapper, a new rapper that came out, and you know, you got a street team, and you got all these people that 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 promote for you. They got all your merchandise, they wear your clothes with the with the album cover on it and all that shit. 
and it's all on the streets. That's that's advertisement. That's all that is, you know. So you got to bring. You, you got to think about. You got to think about the people that go after too, right? Police officers, military yep. personnel. Yep. You know what I'm yep. saying? They 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 are they they recruit Astronauts. people who are used to taking orders who who, who just want to be on top. Think yep. think about the people that you see the most wearing the the mason clothing. These are people who are are low, well quote unquote low working class people in society who just want to yep. have some type of edge. They tired of being shitted on. Bro, their whole life they just want to so get up a little said bit. that bro yes bro those are the people that's been been kicked on and they right. tired bro and they just want to be a part of something that means something bro exactly. and they feel like they, they feel like that shit right there is they answer bro but a exactly. lot of them guys a lot of them guys they get in that shit bro and they get up in them ranks and shit sometimes they like fuck that i ain't with this shit no more and yeah. some of them be like fuck it i do it you know, so they get bent you know, over. <laughs> so they get yeah, bent bro. Over. I'm telling you, bro. I'm telling you, bro. Like, like it's you got two different type of people in this world, bro. Well, you got three. I say three. Right. You got some of them that'll do that shit, that'll do that shit just for clout. Some that'll say they doing it for family purposes, and some that are just that just won't do it at all. Like, right. nigga, like nigga, be broke their whole life before they become a mason, nigga, because they know what it's about. You see what I'm right. saying? So, but think about so, how many people don't know. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because because masonry is in common knowledge. I got cousins that's like, I'm thinking about becoming a mason. And I'm like, you know, we'll, we'll research that shit, man. You know what I mean? Don't ever just jump into anything. Research that shit. Fi figure out the ins and outs. Learn about the dark parts and, and the light parts. Because even in gang culture, you know what I mean? It, you know, I'm sure that, you know, most of us kind of ran the streets a little bit, you know. Uh, yeah, we all know, know dirt out here. You know, and, and, and when you join up with niggas, you be needing to know. I know niggas that kidnap women. You know what I mean? I'm not hanging out with them. You know yeah, what I mean? Because exactly. what, what you doing? Exactly. I live in Atlanta, bro. I see women get kidnapped. They they literally will pull up in a van and, and throw your ass in there down here. But that's, but that's they set. You know what I mean? That's yep. what they do. You know, yep. so you're you going to join up with people like that. You got to do your research. You got to know the motherfuckers you around. But check you this know? out, though. Yep, and not only that, I'm glad you touched on that because because the Masons is just as smart. These motherfuckers is so smart, bro. They use what they tell you is devil worship just to weed you out. If they got, let's say, let's say you got one lodge, one Mason lodge, and they got 25 new recruits. Them 25 new recruits, I guarantee you, every Mason lodge for you to join a Mason, they need your damn birth certificate. I guarantee you. Why? How do I know? Because they need to know your astro chart. They have to know your natal chart. Why do they need to know your natal chart? Because they, they, your natal chart tells them more about you than your personality, your words, your face, your, your actions can ever tell them. That's real. Your natal chart, bro. Your natal chart tells a, a Mason everything about you. That's hidden knowledge right there. Now, when we was growing up, they taught us that astrology and horoscopes was devil worship. Devil it's worship. devil worship, right? Yeah. But they tell you, they tell you that same shit, but but horoscope, horo means what? So Take it down, brother. We listening. Hey, uh, Horus, 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 Horus became the sun god. Mm -hmm. Horus. So horoscope is this the eye of the sun or the sun's eye, something, something along those lines. So when you think about that and you look at all of these nations that's worshiping sun deities, sun gods, why would horoscope be labeled, um, you so know, why occult does the moon, knowledge? Why does the moon change shape? The moon change shape. It doesn't on its own because it would be impossible. It would be impossible for the uh, Earth to be eclipsing the Moon to give us its Moon phases. Because how would you explain a half of Moon? It would be impossible for that straight line to go down the the center no. of mean, a Moon if the Earth is light, right? Correct. So you, you, so you want to know, know why it does it? Yeah, why? No, nah, I'm telling you that I don't personally know why it goes through every single phase that it goes through, but I can tell you that it is not the earth that causes those moon phases. Hell no, nah, the earth don't move at all, bro. The, the earth you've been living on your entire life, the earth, yo. 
Guys, what is the half moon? Break, break, break down the earth to him, y'all. Break, the earth break, does not give move. Him, right? Give him a vision of the earth, man. Because uh, he, all he sees is the globe. He sees a ball. Y'all break all it down right, I'm going to break it down to you like this, bro. You got a big-ass swimming pool, right? Let's say you got this big-ass swimming pool. Let's say you put a, you put three or four shoes in the middle of that damn swimming pool. You make sure them shoes don't move at all. And then on top of them shoes, you put ants on that motherfucker. Let's say you put ants on that motherfucker on them shoes. Okay. Now, those ants, they don't know shit besides that shoe, them dimensions of that shoe, until they can construct a boat and sail their ass out in that damn, on that swimming pool and see the edge of that damn swimming pool and realize that they're in a swimming pool. Now, once they get to the edge, they got to climb up the edge of the swimming pool, go over the edge of the swimming pool just to get out. Now, the reason why the earth, the reason why the earth don't move is because we are surrounded by water. All of us, no matter where you at, your country is surrounded by water. Continent. Right. Your continent, your country, thing is surrounded by water. This entire, matter of fact, the entire earth is connected. The earth is not disconnected. There are no countries standing on its own besides Australia, to my knowledge, and, and Hawaii and islands. There's a reason why they call them islands. You know what I'm saying? So, so those are standalone island. Those are stand that standalone land. Okay, individual land. So, you know, the earth don't move. In other words, bro, like that shit don't move at all, bro. Like if if the earth was if the earth was spinning as fast as they said it was spinning. You would have the days would be a whole lot shorter. And then on top of that, the closer we get to the sun, like they say it is, the hotter days would be. Uh, you know, days would be a lot hotter than they are now. You don't see none of that shit happening. You know what I'm saying? So when you when you when, when tomorrow morning, I don't know where you at right now, man, but tomorrow morning when the sun go out, you go outside, you look at that damn sun, you tell me that's 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 X amount of billions of miles away from you. And you'll you know, know like, when, yeah. you tell it, when you say that, when you when you say those words, your brain is going to realize that that shit ain't right. You're going to feel that that shit ain't right. Because, because I, I hate to cut you off, brother. I apologize. I'm going to let you get back to your point. No but problem. I, I just had to say, it's, it's like, like you say, when, when, when it's early out and when that sun just come out, you, you can feel it hit your skin. Like, it, 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 it's like, when it's the hottest time of day, you know, like two o'clock in the afternoon, you can feel the heat of the sun radiating down onto your 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 pores, your arm. It's exactly. like you're at the beach and you get a tan, you know. But 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 the hot part of the sun goes away. Why the beach be cold? Why 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 does the beach be cold at night then? Because the sun is gone. It's not at the beach no more. Yep. And you know what else? The trees, the trees are not breaking the wind down. That's another thing. Trees break down winds. Winds is always going to be around no matter how what 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 time what period of life we in. It's going to always be wind. Now, if the earth was spinning in one damn direction as fast as they say it is, how the hell we got different wind patterns? How do we have different wind patterns? How, why is there some days with wind and some not? Why 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 in the hell because, do we have hurricanes? Because the Think spirit of the earth doesn't cause the wind. The wind blows on its own. But we're talking about a, a thousand on, miles per hour spinning globe. Bro, bro, you, know, bro. you gotta understand that when wind couldn't control itself, wind wouldn't have wind wouldn't have a uh what he's saying is, is that when the wind variable speed, it wouldn't have a variable speed, bro. You know what you're talking about. That's Cause, exactly cause right. Because it's, it's a thousand miles per hour. There's, there's exactly. A It'll just there's, be one damn speed. Every time, every time what, you go outside, you got to look out for that wind and know the speed of the wind because the earth moving. That's why. A thousand miles per hour is a fast ass speed. You, you know, I've driven a hundred miles per hour, and I'm like, shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like this is just, it's white, crazy. Yup. Yep. So a thousand miles you, per hour. Come on, bro. You fucking high. Yeah, bro. And you know the saddest part about it is the only reason why a lot of people believe the globe is because they brought that shit home to their parents and their parents believed it. Damn right. Even That's my parents believe it. You know That's what I mean? Because, 
because I had a telescope so so early in life, you know. But but this this uh, let me ask you this because you asking me all these questions about you asking us all these questions about the globe. So let me ask you this: if the, if the globe was real and 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 the sun governs the day and the and the, and the, uh, and the moon governs the night and, and they're supposed to be on opposite sides at all times, how can you see the sun and the moon out at the same exact time if the Earth is round? Exactly. Exactly. Because think about this. If you see the earth and if you see the sun and moon in the same sky, one position on earth, that means if we on the it's globe, because the moon, the moon moves and the earth also moves, but the, earth, the moon moves faster than the earth. So you tell, so you telling me that the people who, who, who where it's nighttime at, they don't see the moon. You if it's daytime moon, where I'm at, I'm in Atlanta, I'm in Atlanta. So and, and and somebody who's living, let's say, uh, in China, right? That's that's behind us, right? About China, supposedly. So so, yeah. so, so somebody, so so if somebody living in China hey, and it's nah, nighttime, nah, you telling me that they can't see? The, hold on, brother. Let me fin let me finish my question. Let me finish my question, brother. If 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 it's supposed to be nighttime there, you telling me that I can see the moon in the daytime, but they can't see the moon in the nighttime? Exactly. That's how you that know it's black, bro. No, listen, man. No, listen, no. listen, listen, brother. Listen, brother. No, We're not no, here no, to no. argue. We just hit a. We no. just hit like the man no. asked you a real question, bro. If if we see the earth, no, do we no. see the moon and the sun no, the no, same no, damn no, time? No. Calm, calm, calm down, everybody. Just answer, yeah. answer the question. Yeah, I brought. I saw him. No, the earth glow, and, and you see. And, the, and, the, and, the, and we and we gotta try not to interrupt each other too. All right. All right, get get back respect. to get, get back to your yeah, your yeah. point, bro. Yeah, respect, when, respect. Because the earth is a globe, when the moon is on one side, those are the other side of the earth who will not be able to see it. But they can. They can. Yeah, you cannot see it because you are on the other side of the earth. How can you? But see this, it? but but this is what I'm saying though. I've got friends all around this world, and they uh -huh. can see the moon when I can see the moon during the daytime. That's and also, lie. there's a. It's not a lie. It's not a lie. lie. You're about to play yourself. I, I didn't listen, call you bro. a liar. I'm a, I'm a, bro, I didn't call you a liar. Wait, 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 wait. So, 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 yeah. so, 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 we gonna do it like this. We gonna we we gonna do it like this because we. we I want hey. you guys to break it down, and, and I want you no, to no, break no, it down. No, I want to say something. How, How come, come the earth is, is, is being seen at the one point of the earth, but not all around? We cannot because see. We cannot hear you. We can't hear you, brother. See the moon at the same time that you see it. Why come? How come when the eclipse happened? Say it one more time. It was hard to hear you. I mean, during the eclipse. Uh huh. Did your friends all over the world tell you they saw the eclipse at the same time you saw it? No. Why? That's simple because the sun is not in the same place at one time. He, he, yeah, I mean, the sun can't be in multiple places at one time. Moon, yeah, yeah. The sun can't be everywhere. So that means so that means, means, so means, 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 means they see the sun, but they see the eclipse. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Depending on where you at. Because, because this look, is another, the eclipse that just happened a while back, right? It, 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 it went down certain parts of the United States. States. And, and, and you will see down, partial, if you are not close, you will see partial. That's how it is. That's some people who experience a partial eclipse, some will experience full eclipse. That's because the sun is not at the same place at all times, and that shows the moon. I, I, the roar. Hey, hey y'all, I got a question for the roar. I got a quick, I got a real question for him, man. He, he got a question for you, brother. All right. All right, this is my question. Do you have a basketball close to you or near you and any you have access to any ball? Yep. I need you to grab any type of ball that you can see right now that you can actually grab and touch. Yep. Put your camera up. You want to see. Put your camera up. All right, now you see that orange. Yep. All right, now now show that show me the round, part of the orange that that's orange green. Show me the part of the right. Yeah, yeah. Hold, I got, I got. Hold on, hold on. Now show me. You see that? You see that orange part? I'm, of, I'm I mean that green. I'm, I'm gonna get rid of this. 
Yeah, I'm, like I'm, about, I'm about to debunk the globe with him real somebody, quick, bro. Somebody pop the camera up and get a disc to prove Watch the point. This, though. Watch this, though. You, I'm, I'm about to show him why it's not possible for this to be a globe. Uh, you, you see that green, that green part? Of, turn the turn the orange around. Yeah, the green part. Now let's say you're right there. You're right there. That's where you are. All right. Now you see an eclipse right directly in front of that green dot right there. You on that green dot. You see an eclipse on that from that green dot. Now you're a human. You can't move fast enough around the globe to see what they see. But now, if I if I'm looking at an eclipse and I'm standing on that green dot right there, and I'm looking at a whole eclipse, and you're looking at the back of that orange right now. Now, if I was on the opposite end of that green dot, and I'm looking at the and I'm standing on the on the butt of that orange, you see that little dot in the middle of that orange where you looking at the other side, the other side of that orange, that yeah, little yeah. dot. Yeah. Anybody standing on that little dot right there, it is totally impossible for them to see any damn thing that I can see from the other side of that orange. And that's what happened. It's impossible. No, no, hold on. And, and, and speaking of that, tell me why y'all say y'all had pictures of Earth, but you never took a picture of the top of the Earth or the bottom of the Earth. You always got that side picture. What's that picture? All the side pictures. Bro, basically, what he's telling you, what he's telling you right now, they don't get what I'm saying. He don't get what I'm talking saying. about. NASA, NASA has yeah. never shown you a real picture of your globe, the raw. That is, it's all been altered. They call composite. Composite. He's an islander, man. Yo, he's Images. an islander, man. He he he's an That's islander. Right. He, you gotta talk straight to him. You gotta talk yeah, straight yeah, to him. Look, yeah, yeah, listen, bro. Listen, bro. Listen, bro. Yeah, I've been NASA yeah, has been never shown yeah, you. What, what you NASA think, has never been, shown you an authentic picture of your Earth, bro. You can't go on no website to pull up a I real mean, picture of the Earth, a real okay. picture. Like if you was in space taking a picture with your cell phone, you ain't got no picture online that can that I, that you can show anybody living right now I'm, to say, look, this is the Earth I'm right now. Like this is it spinning. But, this but is the on, Earth spinning right now. Let, let, let me just say this real quick. It doesn't matter what the shape of the moon is, how far it is. It has nothing to do with the shape of the earth, brother. Hell See, no. When you, when, you, the... when you come asking a bunch of different random questions, that's how I know that your interest isn't in flat earth. Your interest is only in trying to debunk what we're talking about, right? Well, because, you know what? because the heavens yep. above had nothing to do with the ground below, period. Period. Yep. And let me tell you this. It has nothing to do with the ground this. below. And let me explain why why that's true. Let me explain why that's true. Let me explain why that's true. This is why you, that's true. You gotta have an understanding, you know, like brother man, brother like, man. This is why this is why this is true. The sun emits light. The moon doesn't. They're both round. So for you to say, right. for you to say the that the moon is round, the moon is round, and the sun is round, so the earth should be round. That that's what they want you to think. That's what they but want because you to think. Because you're conditioned to think that. They want you to think that <laughs> shit, bro. You can't, you can't just I take the food. Look. 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 So, 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 so when you think about it, 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 it if it's flat, if, if if it's round, or if it's a glow, because 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 yeah, I even done got in arguments with people. Or you, well, you say it's round, but it's flat. It can't be round and flat at the same time, and it can it's be a, a disc is a flat a object CD that has round. a radius. And it has a radius. It's a, a flat object that has a radius, and it has it. No, not it has a diameter. I try to break break that down. Yeah, shit. A yeah. CD is a perfect motherfucking circle. And, and and you telling me you couldn't place something right there, and 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 then build that cosmic thing over it? You get you got to think about it. They want you to believe like all this stuff in the universe, stars, and all that. But we we the only people we know. Ain't nobody Let's, never ever yep. traveled out of space. Now check this and, out. And then they talk about the Van Allen belt. 
and 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 what that is, man, that's the path of the, the sun. Of the earth. I, I, I don't get you guys. You've seen that's the path the of the sun. You've seen places in the sky. You are trying to tell me there's nothing that could that could go. I mean, further than the place. They, they don't go, but the, the thing about rockets are they don't go straight up. Look at any video of any rocket. Saying, they, saying, they, 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 so huh? Saying, like, there's nothing that can go further than the airplanes. Now, well, what we're telling you is that, yeah, you can go further than the air. Brother, I heard your question. Let me answer. Hold on, stop, stop. Brother, let me answer your question. Let him answer. Let him answer. Let me answer your question. You just asked the question. Where you going? Hold on, wait, 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 wait. You're going to move your. Hey, 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 hey. Oh my God! Let him answer your question. Answer your question. Let go further out. Those lights are here. Don't don't know plane go straight up, but I, but I hear what you I hear what you're trying to say. I hear what you're trying to say. Wait, wait, wait. No, don't let, don't know plane go straight up, but but let but let me let me let me let me get in your ear, bro. Hello. I got it. I got it. So listen. When, when I never, we never said that nothing can go higher than an airplane. Of course, things can go higher than an airplane. That's that's light work. The point is, is that every single personnel inside of NASA, every astrophysicist will tell you the same thing. We cannot get out of low Earth orbit. Low Earth orbit means that you're still within the Earth's atmosphere. You're still within. We're still within. We're, we we haven't gone further than that. Because it's now, radiation, they say we can't go back, right? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. They say they forgot the technology to get there. They say they don't lost it. How you, how you lose the technology if you went there? You making phone calls to this motherfucker. You, you guys, you guys, I'm about to tell y'all some, some important about what y'all building on right now, and bro. That's fact. Think, and about that's Think about this. Think about this. Think about this. You said technology you only advances, right? Technology only advances. It never, they don't it tell never. Tell us all the technology. So check this out. When they when they so called landed on they the moon, the when uh -huh. they so called landed on the moon, how the hell did they leave Earth orbit then? Now, now yeah. hold on, hold on, don't 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 speak on that. <laughs> now think about this. What if they didn't leave Earth orbit to land on the moon? That lets yeah. you know that the moon is what inside of the Earth's atmosphere. Right. Right. Which means the sun is also in the Earth's atmosphere. Shit, they got they got videos on YouTube of pilots flying on top of the damn sun, over the damn sun. That's real. That's real. You know what I'm saying? But but, so, but, but all right. So look, I, I, and I and I hate you know I, I did this to uh I did this to Bro Sanchez channel last night, and I hate to talk about somebody else's channel while we having a bill. On the channel and shit, cause that's that's redundant. But if you go to D Marbles page, this man had a phone call with somebody in Australia, and he had a phone call with somebody inside of England. And the I saw that video. Or, or, or yeah, Europe. I fought with, with D Marbles. And they all could see the sun at the same goddamn time. It's yep. impossible on the uh, globe to see the sun, bro. It's totally impossible, impossible to see the sun from Australia, Europe. In America, the motherfucker lives in uh Washington State or something like that, right? He lives exactly. in a, in a northwest region, so it, it's impossible to see the sun all at the same time. And he did this shit simultaneously on Google Hangouts so that we could see for sure that it was nothing fugazi going on. Mm -hmm. Bro, it's bro, it's simple, man. Nobody's trying to deceive people. We not get. I'm not getting paid off this shit. You know what I mean? I don't. I don't get nothing from this. Man, look, you know, this, this is our motive right here, the Roar, just, just to let you know what we actually are doing. We're not wasting our time debate or, or talking about this shit. We're really trying to wake people up because it's sad for us to be, you know, woken up uh, about this shit. And we 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 feel like we're the only ones that know this shit. Like that's some that's that's a that's a burden that don't nobody want. You get what I'm saying? When you know, when you know the truth and the whole world know the lie. Bro, bro, you an outcast, bro, and it, and it hurts. It hurts when you can't express the truth to everybody, and they can't, they can't well welcome that shit with open arms because of the deception that's been laid. The foundation of the deception is strong. It's strong as hell. Well, that's why they need secret societies. Facts. They need secret societies to keep their foundation strong. Now, the reason why they lying is because everything they told your ass was fake is fucking real. And I'm going to just tell you straight flat out. I'm the one to tell you that shit. Everything they told you is fake is real. Is real.
People is out there killing people, eating people, all kind of shit. There are different human beings on this earth with us right now. Right now. They don't want us to know this shit. If it hit the news tomorrow, it's still going to be people that believe it and don't believe it. If it came on the news tomorrow that uh, 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 all of the elite politicians are actually fucking reptile people from an ancient fucking race of people that came here outside the ice wall and they came here to take over this little pond we live in or some shit and, and, and it hit the news and the whole world started World War Three. People still going to doubt that shit. They going to still say, oh, that's some bullshit. They lying. Them, them motherfuckers ain't no reptiles. This, this must be some kind of kind of trick or something. This is this is how deep the deception goes. Because it, when it, the truth does come out, mm -hmm. they had to they had to like this is how you deceive a, a nation, man. Whatever you want them to, to forget about, you deem that to be fake or fairy tale to the next generation. The next generation. This, this is a this is a uh, you know a Jewish uh, this is a Jewish country, right? Is 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 controlled yep. opposition. So so what they did, uh, cause cause I was big on Hitler uh, when I was a kid, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? And, and I, I caught a lot of fleck like about that shit when uh, being inside of um, you know high school and shit like that. You know people always tell me like, you know Hitler hated you too and all that. Oh, man, I. Ain't, the, the point was knowledge. I could give a damn about how a nigga feel about me personally. Yeah, that the shit point ain't got nothing to do with me. Yeah, yeah. You I'm know? pretty sure your curiosity about Hitler was more so along the lines of why would this man go to this, 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 these links to do this to these people? Exactly. So, and as a, and, natural, and, as a child, that's a natural question. You damn right. I could care less about his hate. That shit ain't got nothing to do with me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, but what I found out was that everything that I was being taught about him, well, 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 uh, about sixty to seventy percent of it was bullshit. You know what I'm saying? He he yep. actually had, he actually was into some some old another other shit. They only want to talk about the genocide. You know what I mean? And and that's that was like the beginning of my you know I guess conspiracy theory attitude. I don't know what the fuck to call the shit. You know what I'm Man. saying? But but a yep. big part of my curiosity because then I felt like damn I gotta read more into motherfuckers. You know what you I'm really, saying? I can't yep. just go off of what people tell me. I got to read into every single oh, little oh, thing oh, because oh, motherfuckers oh, is deceiving me. They really is, you know? man. Them books, and, 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 like Bro Sanchez said, them books is binding. They bind you they to their literature. They make you feel like everything you that person said is true. They make you right. feel like you know something without doing the work, bro. And that's exactly. the worst part about the world, bro. Like, they don't want you to be explorers. They don't want you to find out the, the fucking, the, the fucking all-curing fruit that, that may be growing in the earth. Cause if you find it, what the what they they gonna take they gonna take the credit from your ass. The roar, and I'm talking to you. If you take your ass to South America and find a fruit that cure all diseases, do you think they're gonna let you live and take the credit? Hell to the gnaw. They're gonna tell your ass where did you find it. They're gonna act like they're your friend, and when they don't need you no more, they're gonna kill you, wipe you from history, and they're gonna use that shit for their day agenda. That oh, lets you know the type do. of people you're dealing with. All he got to do is look up holistic doctor's deaths in the last year. <laughs> yep. You know what I'm saying? Look look at look up holistic doctor's deaths within the last year. It's Shit, just... look at Dr. Sabi. Dr. Gone. Sabi. He gone, bro. He gone. gone. That nigga, Straight bro, that nigga, that. bro, that nigga was a prophet, bro. That bro, bro, that nigga knew he was knowledgeable and they knew who he was talking to. They knew by the color of his skin who was going to listen to this man. They was like, yo, this man, this man really know the truth. This man been living in Honduras out of the out of the reach of the United States government for almost his whole life. So yeah. so this is why he slipped under the radar, just in case people don't know. If he would have been if this man won a case in New York City years ago, this man won a case where he cured cancer, cured HIV, cured AIDS, cured all Herbies. of these different ailments yep. from herbs. And they took this man to court and said, how are you curing these people? He said, well, the body is consistent of all carbon. So it would make it would, it would mean common sense to repair the body with carbon based nutrients. So he said, in order to repair the body of any Ill illness, you need carbon based plants. Every human being is plant based and water based. It is not it, it, it is not toxic based. So when you when you when you eat animal flesh, you're 